Right, today's dish hall presented by Stone Academy. It was a big day on TV yesterday. There was a lot of yelling going on in my house and cheering. I imagine so. <laughs> and a lot of households all across the world. Tiger Woods winning his fifth Masters and 15th major title on Sunday. So this was the 83rd edition of the Masters mm -hmm. in Augusta, Georgia. So you knew it. Everybody knew it. It was a big, big deal. One of the greatest comebacks in sports history. Right. Tiger overcoming career back problems. And again, back surgery four times, Teresa. Wow. And uh, this was his first Masters. Win since all the way back in 2005. There are so many different scenarios that could have happened on that back nine, and I've been in I've been in the, that spot before. I've been in a position where I've won, and I've been in a position where I've lost. Um, but I just kept telling myself that at least I'm in that position. I heard the win puts Woods just three majors behind the all-time record holder Jack Nicholas. Jack Nichols, not Nicholas. <laughs> um, so I'm a little indifferent with Tiger. Yes, I was rooting for him yesterday, but I go back and I think yeah. of the scandal, and it's like, oh, a little bit yeah. of a womanizer there. But my, as my husband said, greatest of all time, uh, no one can come close. And there were some good moments. Did you see Tiger went and hugged his son? Oh, it was so emotional, kind of like it did with his dad yes, when exactly. he won uh, 10 years prior. That right? was all over social media. They put the pictures back to back. So it was great to see that. Yeah, and it was fun game. to watch. Oh, yeah, it was exciting, right? for sure. Yeah. All right. Uh, the night everyone oh. was waiting for has finally happened. Are you a Game of Thrones fan? Oh, yeah. You oh. are, so you were way into this. <laughs> I was into it, Teresa. <laughs> 20 months. You almost had to wait two years for this. Game of Thrones debuting last night on HBO. Uh, we're not going to give away any spoilers, of okay. course, because no, I don't no, need no, any no. angry emails this Monday. <laughs> Uh, but I'll tell you, only five more episodes are left now. Game of Thrones starring Maisie Williams. She's 22 today. Maisie plays Arya Stark. Okay. So was it everything it was cracked up to it be? It really was. I mean, there's a little bit of everything in this episode. So if uh, you didn't see it yet, you will, let's put it this way. They will not be disappointed. Okay. It was a good episode. But every time I watch it, I'm like, oh, that means there's one less episode. That's true. It's that, coming yeah, to an end. It's kind of bittersweet. So... Wow. wow. All right. Stay tuned. Coca Cola and Disney are partnering for the new Star Wars Galaxy's Edge Parks. Coke is unveiling custom bottles that will be sold at the highly anticipated Star Wars land. This is definitely something that people are waiting to open. The bottles will be fashioned into a round, well, there it is, droid like shape. Custom bottles of other drinks like Sprite and Dasani water also will be available. The Star Wars Edge, Galaxy's Edge Parks are set to open in Disneyland in California. That's May 31st and August 29th. That's at Disney's Hollywood Studios in Florida. Trace